Already had one. I already have one in. I had this in for about 10 15 minutes. But, um, yeah. Copenhagen Natural. Very good natural dip. Cheaper than Copenhagen Snuff or Copenhagen Long Cut. So, if you like naturals from Copenhagen, this is definitely a way to go. It's cheaper. And we're going, I'm doing Levi Garrett. Two of you. Levi, what are you doing? I'm doing something to skull. Classic. Mint, long cut, long, like long dick style now. I'm saying long cut. <laughs> and the reason why we're not spending our mud jugs is because we left them in the house and we didn't feel like going back and getting them. So, next best thing, the Pepsi mud jug. If you ever want to buy, if the you Mountain Dew mud jug. <laughs> Other so, Mountain Dew mud jug. If you ever want to buy, hold your shit right here. If you ever want to buy a mud jug for cheap shit, buy yourself a Pepsi. Drink it, dump it out, whatever the fuck you want to do. It's like two dollars, because that's how fucking expensive it is for bullshit reasons. But I promise you, that's as much as you get. It doesn't spill. Put the cap on, of course. But uh, if I even if I take off the cap, it doesn't fucking spill. <laughs> Don't throw it in my car. No. But it doesn't. Spill. Hey, by the way, guys, we're gonna review my car today. My car's a 1999 Mercury Mountain Year 5 liter V8. Oh, your neighbor dollar. just gave me a fucking stare down. See, this is a <laughs> sunglass roof. Sunglasses means um Ava Drive. <laughs> anyway, what the fuck I is can't do a so creepy right I now? can't do a car review. I mean I can't start my car for you guys right now because the battery's dead, but yeah. Fucking Turn your shit off. Alright oh, guys, so the packability on this is it packs very good in the lip like all Copenhagen's and you don't get very many floaters it does have a good bit of stems in it though which sucks but but Copenhagen it's the best shit ever if you like natural dips and you can't afford Copenhagen snuff or Copenhagen long cut good alternative where I live this cost me about I think it was four bucks and um the Coming in long cut around here is like five bucks, but definitely coming in long cut's better, definitely better than this. But the flavor on it kind of tastes like coming and snuff, and coming in long cut, but it tastes more like coming and snuff. Well, Levi Garrett, you guys ever had uh, Taylor's Pride? That's what it tastes like, but Taylor Pride is the drier version of Levi Garrett, basically. Still good chew. Does that? It has a lot more Sims than Red Man. I like Red Man, Golden Blend, all of them, but I never had Silver Blend or uh, whatever the fuck it was called. But Silver Blend? It's pretty good though. I would recommend, but it's so fucking. It's a lot of money for just a bag of Levi Garrett. I think Beach Nut costs more than Levi Garrett right now. It does. That's surprising because Beach Nut. Well, is yeah, back to the cocaine natural view. This stuff out of 10. I give it a nine and a half. It's good natural, but not as good as cocaine long cut. And yeah, so this skull here, a skull. It's all right. I mean, Copenhagen is so much better. But I mean, yeah, if you can't, well, don't want Copenhagen. Here's a good mint and a uh, Grizzly Premium Dark Mint. It's ready to go too. It's fucking grizzly, so yeah, I go with that. But, I know I was sure sure I want to show you all the way, boys, but this car was free, and you know, why would you turn down a free car, especially when it runs? And also, don't know if you guys uh seen the college football, but uh, Clemson baby, yep. fucking football champs. Fuck Alabama. Fuck the roll tide. Clemson Tigers. But my favorite team. College teams, West Virginia or Cal U. Mine's Notre Dame. And I really don't have a second favorite one. But Notre Dame, they did Shea this year. But I guarantee we'll do somewhat decent next year. 
And all you Pitt fans, fuck you, you, you won by a field goal. Congratulations. Hey, by the way, shout out to uh, USC for kicking uh, Penn State's ass. We live in Pennsylvania, but I fucking hate Penn State. I mean, I don't have a problem with them. For being from Pennsylvania, they're number five seed in the fucking college. That's pretty damn good, I hate to tell you. Steelers, good job, baby. You won last night. Steelers, baby, all the way. Let's beat them Pats. Fuck the Patriots. Fucking ball deflated faggots. I know I'm from Pennsylvania too, but I like the Packers. Congrats. Good win on Good the win. Cowboys. Fuck the Cowboys. Fuck there them you all. Go. Fucking kicking Cowboys. Ass. But that must say your team is the Steelers. But I thought your second favorite team was the Raiders. No, nah, <laughs> that was until they lost. Yeah, that's when I heard Derek Carr got injured. Yeah. Well, anyway, my first truck is going to be a 1997 Dodge 2500 uh, V8 Magnum. It's a good truck. I'm going to put a utility belt on and put a welder because I want to be a welder. I'll probably have me a Honda Civic or a Mitsubishi something shit. Some old ass car, but it's free, so he gives a fuck. Mine's free too, I just have to put a lot of work into it. Well, actually, I just need to put a brake line and gas line in it. I know you guys are going to call us, um, I guess you could say pussies for getting free cars, but, you Man, know, fuck you guys. I you work. I actually have a job. I have a farm. I'm so, getting a um, farm for it. Yeah. My, plus, my dad want me to have it, so it's not like I'm getting it for free. I have to, like, put work into it, too. My dad wanted to give me that truck because it, it was my pap's truck, and it's a really special truck to me. I mean, I don't work. I get shit handed to me on my dad's side. I'm not going to lie, but uh, I work hard in sports, so if you all, uh, yeah. It's not like we beg for them either. Yeah. It's like they gave them to us to hand us down and keep in the family and that. I literally got this on 4th of July. <laughs> I got mine of, like, my dad said that it's my, like, like beer <laughs> shit. That's horrible. They got here in Nashville. I know. But, um. Yeah, so overall review, very good, recommend it. This is very good too, recommend it, Levi. Tastes yeah. good, I mean, okay. it's good natural, <laughs> but definitely Copenhagen Long Cut's way better. Good cheap natural though from Copenhagen. Any shoe, I swear, go with Levi Garrett's good shit. Or Red Man. Any of the Red Man's but Silver Bun, because I've never had it. Silver Bun's supposed to be like sugar free or whatever, so I doubt that tastes good. It's probably like a natural chew. It's like the Copenhagen snuff a chew. <laughs> also, bitch but not nut. As good, probably. <laughs> bitch nut wintergreen is pretty good too. <laughs> bitch, <laughs> bitch nut. <laughs> this guy used to love beach nut wintergreen. He used to chew all the time. We went hunting this year. On the first day of hunting, we literally kill a full bag of like beach nut wintergreen and original and Levi Garrett, dude. Also, <laughs> while I was just sitting there chewing, of course, uh. I was also just thinking, and it was the first day, so all I could see it legally was a buck. I was like, there's a lot of fucking doe. <laughs> we literally saw 30 doe. Like, they count, they were fucking taunting us. Oh, and he, this asshole broke my cooler. He fell asleep on it, and he broke my cooler. I didn't mean to, it happened. Yeah, and on the first day of buck season this year, I missed a hammer of a 10 point. I thought it was an 8 point, but we got trail cam pics of it now. After season, it's a nice 10 point. I'm telling you, it's probably about not even exaggerating that tall main beam. Like, it's tall. Let's tell the cowboy. I had, I had a, um, I was using a uh, 7mm. By the way, all the guns we use, I use 7mm running to Magnum. Me, I use a 270 Winchester. It's a Remington 700. Love that gun. It's my baby. I mean, I just got a. For Christmas, so I didn't get to use it, I just got a 243. Didn't even get to see it because, well, my nan took it, so I uh, have to wait till a little bit to get it because they're in South Carolina because it's cold as fuck out here. Well, basically, when he hunts with me, he just uses my, uh, oh, what the hell was it? How a 30 yard 6? Yeah, how a 1500 30 yard 6. Never shot it, and it seemed like a pretty good gun. My dad uses a 300 wind bag for deer. It's fucking hilarious. Alright, so, yeah, this video is getting pretty long, so, this is a different 69 here. 
And we're out, y'all. The outlaw. Out. Bye, dogs. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Be Dipper here, and I'm out, y'all.